My name is Tan Lee. I'm founder and CEO of Emotive Life Sciences. I think I've been an entrepreneur for what seems like a decade almost now. I first started my career as a young lawyer at Freehills and very quickly realized that technology was driving the biggest changes in our world today and I wanted to be part of the action. Where that's taken me is into this realm of brain research uh, and what we've been able to do over the last several years is to democratize the area around brain imaging, allowing almost anyone in the world, uh, whether they're a neurologist or a psychologist or just a student or a tinkerer, to be able to have access to brain scanning and brain imaging and drive new innovations in understanding the human brain as well as to find application areas that are novel and new around a brain-computer interface. Well, the most rewarding aspect about the work that I do is really seeing how our community uh, is embracing this technology platform. One of the highlights for me is seeing people actually being able to have their lives changed through rehabilitation by being able to, say, move an electric wheelchair simply with their minds. I think this is the most exciting aspect of seeing uh, how other people uh, embrace and use uh, what we've created. For me, it's all about passion and what really inspires you and captivates your imagination and fires that, that your heart. If you can find something that you're truly passionate about, it won't be just a job, it's something that is of a higher calling, it's something that has meaning to you. That's the most important thing about any, any sort of uh, lifelong endeavour. Over the next 10 years, I really would like to see um, some major changes in the way that um, we engage with the brain as well as the understanding of the human brain that's enabled by this intersection of cloud computing, bioinformatics and very personalised, um, contextualised brain scanning. This is the last human frontier. It's something that can have a really big impact on our world uh, and yet there's not enough that's understood about the human mind. I think Australia is a country that's that's young and because of that we we kind of think there's nothing could possibly go wrong you know we can we can always be be optimistic and things will be it will be okay um, and I think that's there's something very positive and uh, infectious about that notion you have to be optimistic you have to be grounded but at the same time you have to be a believer in what's possible for the future and I think that's a, a really important um, aspect of Australia that I've carried with me throughout my life and my career.